Hi everybody, I'm Leah of CJ Drill. And if this is your first time here, I just want to welcome you. We're a home improvement channel where, well, beginners are welcomed as well. Now today's video is a little unusual because it has to do with this right here. Now what it is, is it's called mirror effects. And essentially what it is, is it's a mirror in a spray can. I saw it. I was intrigued by it, and I thought, I got to give this a shot. I want to see if it actually looks like a mirror. I went to my local hardware store and I picked up a pane of glass. Now, I'm using Windex to clean the glass, but you can use any kind of glass cleaner. But what I will say is the most important thing is it's got to be spotless. Any kind of grease or dirt, you got to get it off of there. Now the next thing I have to tell you is it's got to be completely dry. Don't start to paint unless your glass is perfectly dry. And the other thing is it's got to be lint free. So my glass is clean. It's time to paint. Make sure you work in a well ventilated area. Open doors, open windows. Now I'm applying my first coat and I'm making certain that I'm taking my time. I'm applying it light and I'm holding the can about 12 inches away from the glass. It's going to take several coats to get that mirror effect. Now I'm on my second coat, but I got to tell you this, this paint dries quickly, just a minute between coats. And it's going to take three to five coats to get that mirror effect. Now, I've put on five coats, and if you can see, the back side of the mirror is reflective, okay? But it doesn't look like a mirror would, but it is reflective on the back side. The side that looks like a mirror is facing the paper. So what we have to do is we have to lift this up, and now is the moment of truth. Let's take a look, see what we have. Big reveal, and... Wow, look at that. That's pretty good. Now, now, I will say this. It's not as clear as a mirror, like a real mirror, but it's still pretty impressive. And I could see a lot of uses for something like this. So what do I think, honestly, about mirror in a can? Well, I'll tell you, it reminds me of when I went camping a few years ago and I brought along bacon in a can and bread in a can. And my buddies were all like, what the heck is this stuff? But they ate it up. And it wasn't quite like bacon that you would get at home or the bread that you would get at home, but it was still pretty good. And that's what this product reminds me of. It's not quite like a mirror, but it's pretty close and it's pretty doggone good. And I can see where you could use it for certain projects around the house. Maybe you got a coffee table, you want a mirror effect, this might be the thing. Or maybe you've got an old window and you want a mirror effect on that window, this would be the product for creating that or that illusion. Now what I want to tell you is this, okay? It was tough for me to find. I had to go to several stores before I located one can. And when I finally did find it, that's exactly what they had. They had one can. So what it kind of tells me is this is a very popular product, okay? Probably for people that do crafts. That's what my guess would be. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a link in the description below so you can locate it for yourself and check it out, okay? Now, before I go, can I encourage you? Can I encourage you to subscribe and ring that bell icon so that you get our videos as soon as we upload them? This is Leah saying you can do this. See you next time.